at a rally in August is when he started to mention about this idea of putting forth a special prosecutor to send her to jail, at least in his words. This is something I just I can't impress upon you enough how, how many of Trump's supporters that we spoke to said this was one of the reasons why they really gravitated toward Donald Trump. But now his uh, campaign manager, Kellyanne Conway, says that the president-elect has had a change of heart. I think when the president-elect, who's also the head of your party now, Joe, tells you before he's even inaugurated he doesn't wish to pursue these charges, it sends a very strong message, tone and content to the members. And I think Hillary Clinton still has to face the fact that a majority of Americans don't find her to be honest or trustworthy. But if Donald Trump can help her heal, then perhaps that's a good thing. Um, I do... Look, I think he's thinking of many different things as he prepares to become the president of the United States. And things that sound like the campaign aren't among them. Now, Carol, I know I mentioned that uh, I've heard Donald Trump say this many, many times at so many of his rallies. I want you now to listen to some of the examples. These are just some of the examples that we found. Hillary Clinton may be the most corrupt person ever to seek the presidency of the United States. She is a crooked one, there's no question. Hillary Clinton will be under investigation for a long, long time for her many crimes against our nation, our people, our democracy, likely concluding in a criminal trial.